he is ready to be filmed. So, this is the skink. I thought it was just a lizard, but it's actually a skink. The reason I'm wearing these gloves is because his, um, claws are very sharp. And yet, I'm not sure whether he bites or not. I mean, I know they obviously can bite it, but... Like, I don't, I'm not afraid of getting bit. I'm just afraid that he could be poisonous and he could hurt me. So, that's why I'm going to wear these gloves. He's just a little guy. He's not, he's... When you grab him like this, he cal he's calm. So, if you see his tail right there, it's been cut off. That's from where the cat got him. The cat itself did not chop the tail off. See, lizards and certain other animals drop their tails to confuse a predator. So, this is that was just his little technique of confusing the little predators. See, he's scared, but he's just a little fella. He ain't gonna get hurt. It's okay, buddy. Come back. Come back. Oh, well, yeah. See, that's why, that's why when you get a hold of them, you can't let them go. Alright, so, that, everyone, was the scheme. I hope you all enjoyed this episode of Bit of Science, and we'll see you all next time. Bye-bye. The only way this little guy can hurt you is his powerful claws. He can obviously bite, but he's not particularly aggressive and does not pass any poison through any fangs of sorts.